Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is like a whole house clean with me. This day I was getting ready to go visit my sister who just had a baby and I was very excited to do that but my house was a mess and I needed to clean it up before I left. Editing this whole thing I did when I was at home during quarantine because I was very sick with COVID unfortunately. Well after I edit it all, it will not download and let me upload because it was too large of a video and I didn't have enough storage. So I'm re-editing it to make it smaller, just to let you guys know what was going on.
to pop on and say i'm sorry about all the weird lighting we have lots of large windows in this house which i absolutely love but i'm still figuring out the best angles and stuff for all the lighting and as you guys can see in my mirror i do have a ring light attached to my tripod so i'm still figuring it out so just bear with me guys until we get it situated eventually i am going to be switching out all the light bulbs for white lights because half of them are orange and it does not help with my videos. <laughs> um, and then in some of like the windows, at least the little ones in the bedrooms, we are gonna get new blinds because the ones that we have are just not good. So that should also help in the future. But as you guys can see now, we um, moved on to the master bedroom. I'm going to make the bed, um, wipe everything down, pick some stuff up. I didn't show me wiping down the dresser um, but I did wipe down the dresser as well and then swept and mopped and then we're going to put away a ton of laundry. What will happen? 
As you guys can tell, all the laundry in the world is being folded right now. I couldn't even tell you how many loads of laundry I actually ended up folding this day because as I was cleaning, I was washing and drying other loads of laundry and I did end up putting every little thing away. I just didn't film every load of laundry. I only filmed this which ended up being so much i had to speed up some of this um quite a bit faster than what i normally do because 
you would be watching me fold laundry for an hour if I didn't. Um, same later on in the video when I do all the dishes. I had to speed up quite a bit of it because there was just so much. You would have watched a whole other hour of me just washing dishes. So bear with me. Let me know what you guys prefer if you want me to cut chunks of things out and not speed it up or if you like it all fast when I have like 10 loads of laundry or a ton of dishes to do. Um, just let me know what you guys prefer. I've tried different things in different videos. Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to figure out what would be best because as you guys can tell, this video is still an hour long. So let me know in the comments down below what you guys prefer. here I'm just hanging up a few jackets um, we do have a coat closet right in the front of the house and um, that's where I keep all of our jackets which is amazing to have um, and then all of the rest of our clothes obviously goes into our closet and then Tori and I both have a side of the closet and in the middle of the closet as you guys can kind of see is this little shelving unit which I have for all of our shoes um, this closet is huge and it's amazing and I love the fact that we can have all of our stuff in one place and it's separated and there's plenty of room for everything. It's fabulous. But here, just putting everything on hangers, putting everything away. My closet is not completely sectioned and organized. I do need to do it, but it's all put away. It's all clean. It's good enough for me. So that's kind of how it's been rolling lately. <laughs> so yeah. But I did just want to come on here and talk to you guys for a little bit about life and chit chat with you and update you guys because I know my upload schedule, I really haven't had a schedule and it's been a total hot mess. I feel like I haven't been able to catch a break, like I haven't been able to breathe. Life has been so busy the past couple months and it has been so hectic, I couldn't even put it into words for you guys. And um, as you guys know, I also work full time and then, um, you know, social life, you know, t making time for myself and my boyfriend and our family and all of the things that people have to do, you know. So it's been really hard for me to 
not mainly film it's just been hard for me to edit because i will have like five or six hours of footage and it takes a really long time to go through it all um i love doing this i don't want you guys to think i don't i just have a hard time finding the time throughout the day um to get these things done I've also, on top of working so much and my life being hectic, I've been getting sick a lot lately. And so that's been really hard, not feeling well and um, having low energy all the time. And then, you know, having chronic headaches lately to sit down and stare at my phone for five hours has just not been realistic. Um, and then currently, as I'm doing this, I'm actually at home quarantined because I did test positive for COVID, unfortunately. And this is my second time getting it this year because I did get it back in February of the beginning of this year. And um, this time around, it's been a lot harder on me physically than it was last time. And um, I'm showing more symptoms and having more issues. And I'm very grateful to have Tori here quarantined with me and taking care of me. Um, but he did actually have to take me to the hospital last night and I got some meds and I just wanted to get my lungs checked out because of my asthma and, um, I am feeling much better today and that's why I'm actually finally taking the time to sit down and do some of this editing. So I just want you guys to know kind of what was going on and that I'm doing fine. <laughs> Life's just been kind of throwing us a lot of curveballs lately but I'm going to be continuing with YouTube and I just really appreciate all of you that are sticking around and being so patient with me. Um, but enough about all that <laughs> here. Um, as you guys can see, we moved right into my laundry room. Um, I'm just taking out the garbage. I'm going to sweep and do a quick mop and just get this all strained up and move right along into the kitchen, which will be the final room. Thank goodness. <laughs> so... I'll let the music play. It's about one o'clock almost, and I kind of fully started after I talked to that guy for the estimate, and that was around 10.30, I think. Um, and I've got in the living room done, the bedroom done, put all that laundry away. The bathroom I had already picked up this morning, and I deep cleaned that not too long ago. Um, so I just swept and mopped that in the hallway, and then I just cleaned up the laundry room I have the laundry room left so i'm feeling very proud of myself for getting it done uh, i'm about to pop a pizza in the oven because i am starving and then we're gonna get crack lacking at this kitchen i'm not tired but i'm just like ready to be done you know i'm ready to be done so uh, Now that I brought in the water and the soda from my car, I'm actually going to just take a couple minutes and clean up 
the fridge. I'm not fully doing a deep clean. I'm just going through, throwing away some old stuff, checking a few things, kind of organizing it because I am going to put that entire case of water in the fridge. I cannot drink water unless it is cold. I just, I can't. I absolutely can't. So um, we don't have a lot of leftovers. We're really good about eating them up or making you know, decent sized meals so that we don't have a significant amount of leftovers. Um, so we mainly have condiments and drinks in our fridge. I don't know. It's just the way it's always been with us. Um, we cook a lot with fresh stuff. Like we cook with vegetables and things like that. We just eat it pretty quickly and we don't buy a lot at a time. We also live in a tiny town where we don't have a full size grocery store. So there isn't a lot of fresh product right in the town that we live in so when we do get fresh product we just get a little bit um here and there and we use it up right away pretty much um because it's just it's nice to have we don't have it on a regular basis we are next summer planning on doing a garden in our backyard we um like i said the outside is going to be a whole project and we actually have that handyman he did actually come out um a day or two ago and he cleaned up a ton of the yard we still have uh the tree branches to trim and you know rake the whole yard pull out the weeds some of that stuff but tori has been um he laid down grass seed and he's been watering the yard we got all of the stuff that had to go to the dump um completely picked up even just doing all that the yard looks so much better but um we're doing all the prep work <laughs> Uh, before winter hits and then next summer we are going to be putting in a full garden so that we can have regular fresh product it's um, something that we attempted to do the beginning of the summer during the spring when we were living in the trailer house uh, with just like a small planters and like a raised bed um, but now that we're going to be buying this house we're actually so fortunate to be able to put in a full garden which is something Tori has been wanting to do forever and I'm extremely excited about that. But um, here I'm just cleaning things up, throwing away a few things. And then we're going to move right on into doing the dishes. Uh, the dishes took me forever this day. I had so much. I'm also a little anal because I have to wash dishes by hand. So I really like to take my time to scrub things thoroughly. And then um, I do also add... A little bit of bleach in the water a lot of people say you shouldn't some people do it you know just for my own OCD and sanity I have to do it otherwise I think the dishes just aren't clean which I know it's a mental thing but I have to um, I did wipe down the counters I didn't really show it on the other side of the kitchen um, because I was just speed cleaning along but everything did get completely wiped down all the dishes got washed and dried and put away and then um, we will finish up by sweeping and mopping the kitchen but I am done blabbing and I will let you guys enjoy the music. Easy. I know you're not happy by me being cheesy. So pardon me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Pardon me. 
everything for today's video i hope you guys really enjoyed thank you so much for watching don't forget to give it a like comment subscribe if you're new and i'm gonna see you guys in the next one bye